hello friends you are welcome to my channel thank you for tuning in thank you it has been a while i'm back thank you for tuning in thank you for tuning in in today's video i will be this video i will be talking on gloves and on clothes i'll be talking on clothes clothes is highly medicinal but many people did not know i want to share some of the benefits for my youtube friends for you to know the benefits of this god-given as a spice it's a herb you can use it as herbs and you can use it as spice in your food and it's highly medicinal see this is this is cloves this is cloves i'll put it in the, in the in the flat let's see like this i can see can you see it is this is cloves, cloves, C L O V E S, cloves. It's highly medicinal. So I'll be talking on it now. And I will tell you how you can prepare it to have the maximum benefits. Have the maximum benefits of this uh, herb or spice. Anyhow you want to call it. So i'll be looking down because i'm getting some point from my phone so it has a lot of benefits it's have a lot of nutrients it's high in antioxidants cloves they are it's high in antioxidants which help in uh, removing of free radicals from the removing toxins from the body. Cloves is very good in detoxifying the liver, cleaning the system. You want to clean up your liver, removing uh, liver fat. This is very, very good for it. And it's an antibacterial. It contains high level of antibacterial in it. Instead of you taking an uh, antibiotic, you can resolve in taking this. It will work properly. And these gloves again, I've used it, I'm talking out of experience now. I'm not a medical doctor, I'm not an, any health consultant, but I'm, I'm talking out of experience because I've used it and it really worked for me. Clove can help in toothache. Clove can help in toothache. If you have toothache, and I'll be telling you how, what you can combine, different things that you can combine for different ailments or sickness that it, this clove can help if you have toothache you can use clove how you will use clove for toothache is you will you will ground it into powder add cinnamon add cinnamon powder to it then put a little well, a drop of water can put a drop of water make a, a paste very thick then you put it to where the place you are having the toothache you put it there and close your mouth for like maybe 10 to 20 minutes or 10 minutes let's say 10 minutes leave it there all the pain will six it work like magic this this clove it work like magic for toothache it work like magic when you add cinnamon to it, you grind it into powder, add cinnamon to it, put little water and make a paste and put in the particular place that is paining you, the, the tooth that is aching you, the pain will relieve immediately. It works like magic. And it also helps with, with mouth odor. It helps with mouth odor. If the breath out of your mouth is not fresh, you can use this also. At times, mouth odor is not as if maybe the person did not brush it. At times, it's from the within. Maybe what you have eaten the previous night, 
if it, not, it digests, but if the liver is not clean, your breath will not be fresh. Bad breaths have to do with when the liver is not clean. So when you take this, when you, when you shoot, when you can shoot, when you shoot it, it helps to give a uh, fresh breath. It helps for fresh breath, and also it helps for uh, flu and cold. If you have catar, you have running nose, flu, this you can boil in a kettle. You can boil it, pour the water, and steam. You can steam with it, inhale the, the steam, and every conjunction in the nose will be open up. If there's any nose conjunction, steam it, you will the, boil it and steam. It will relieve every congestion in your nose. Just put, put it, the water after boiling enough. You know, if the if the cloves are infused into the water, you pour into the bucket and cover yourself with clothes to steam it. The, the steam coming out of the what the clove water will remove every congestion from your nose and you'll be able to breathe normally, freely, and the flu will, will also reduce or stop so it's helpful flu also it's help i've said it help in detoxifying the liver if your liver is full of toxins it will show on your skin it will show from the breath it will show it will cause different type of sickness that you you may not know so that we need to be detoxifying our liver once a while anytime i need i i see that the sign that i need to detoxify my liver I do I use it again so I always like to have this at home it's it's really help like this you can be taking one of it every day one a day or two a day as you can because it it doesn't taste nice it's somehow it have a mental taste a mental taste it's somehow peppery like that it's like pepper some people call it pepper but I don't see it as pepper it's very it's highly medicinal so gloves is very important it cures so many ailments starting from the liver it's high in antioxidant it also protects against cancer it also kills bacteria it improves the liver health it may regulate blood sugar it also regulates blood sugar those that have a, a high blood glucose it helps to reduce high blood glucose. It helps to re regulate sugar level and it promotes bone health. That means it contains calcium. It promotes bone health, promotes bone health, and it also reduces stomach ulcer. If you have ulcer, you can take this. It helps to relieve the, the pain. It helps to kill those bacteria because all the uh, there are some bacteria in the colon that are causing those ulcer. So when you are taking gloves, it kill the bacteria and relieve the pain of the ulcer. So gloves is very very recommended. It's very recommended. But when you have high blood pressure, before taking gloves, you have to consult your doctor. And if you have high blood glucose again, consult your doctor. If you have any health issue, before you take any herbs as a natural remedy, like glow, like clove, clove, you have to consult your doctor before taking it. So this is what I have today to share to you, my YouTube family, that this herbs or this spice, you can be, you can grind it into powder and be putting in your food as a spice spice up your food but me i use it as a herbs anytime i want to detoxify my liver i use this and another way you can take this as tea that will work more effect effectively by detoxifying your, detoxifying your system and strengthening your immune system is taking like two tablespoon take like two tablespoon or one tablespoon as you can tolerate the 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 heat of this of this you boil 10 to 15 minutes or 20 minutes then sieve it in a, a cup 
or don't put it in a plastic rubber put it in a, a glass a a cup let it cool down then put lemon half lemon in a cup of this tea put half lemon in it it help in detoxifying your body put lemon and also you can add ginger when you are boiling it when you are boiling this clove add ginger add lemon you can cut lemon now you may use both the back the seed everything cut lemon full lemon cut everything and put it into the pot add two tablespoons of this clove and add uh, a thumb uh, size ginger you can dice it you can grate it and put it in it boil it then when you cool down put it in a cup and add honey to it it will clean your body system you will you will you will come back to thank me it work really really good and it treat a lot of ailments starting from your blood sugar your blood, high blood pressure your uh, bacteria oxa flu toothache anything you can talk about because it's very high in antioxidants it's high in antioxidants so this herbs and spice is highly recommended due to my own um, based on my experience with it i so much like it and it really worked for me so this is all i have for you today if you like this video please like if you have yet to subscribe to this wonderful and beautiful channel please subscribe like and share this video because you don't know who this video will help and by you liking and sharing this video youtube will be able to recommend it to many people and they will benefit so see you in my next one Bye.